I'm Shirley O'Shea from Health and Wellbeing. We're going to be focusing on how we can incorporate physical activity into our everyday routines. The first is to look at strength exercises. Strength is important but it's often overlooked in favour of aerobic type activity. This short workout is simple, it needs no equipment, you just need an exercise mat and it's suitable for beginners and advanced. The first exercise we're going to do is a squat. So start with a chair behind you, your feet slightly wider than hip width apart and lower your hips back as if you're going to sit into a chair. Make sure your knees stay behind your toes at all times and just look forwards and tighten your abdominals as you come up. Do as many repetitions as you can until you build up more strength. The second exercise is a stationary lunge, really good for leg strength. So start from the floor, one knee on the ground, try and have your knee, hip and shoulder in alignment. Press your toes into the floor and lift off the ground and lower. Again, try and keep the knees from going over the toes. Go down and up. And again, do as many repetitions as you can. If this is too difficult, you can start by holding on to the back of a chair. If you want a more advanced exercise, you can do a walking lunge or a reverse lunge. The third exercise is a tricep dip. It targets the back of the arms, helps any activity involving pushing. So start by sitting on the edge of a chair with your hands near your hips, fingers facing down, and slide yourself forward till you come off the chair, feet out, and lower your body down until your elbows are bent at about 90 degree angle. Push back up and lower yourself down again. And continue that until you've done enough repetitions as you can manage. And if you want to do more advanced tricep dip, you can extend your legs out straight to make it more difficult. This next exercise is called the plank and it's great for developing core strength. So we start on the mat in a box position with hands under shoulders. Step out with one leg onto the toes and then the other. Hold this position in alignment, keeping a straight line from the head down through the spine, keeping hips up, engaging abdominal muscles and looking slightly ahead Keep focus down all the time and breathe normally. If this is too difficult to hold, just come down on your knees to take a break and go back up again whenever you can. And just increase the amount of time you spend in plank position will be great for all round strength. Mm -hmm.